But all right, number 29 is Big Country. The song Look Away, a uh, kind of a forgotten gem, I think. What do you think, Craig? Uh, it's pleasant enough. It's an okay song. A- another band I have mixed feelings about. When I was younger, can I tell you, when I was younger, I was kind of an a-hole. <laughs> but strictly with regard to your musical. Taste. I was kind of, I was a snob. I mean, not only was I like snobby about pop stuff. I mean, I wouldn't even consider that, but I was sort of like a snob about like, you know, alternative or modern rock stuff because I liked, I liked the song Big Country. I had the album. I still have it, I'm sure. And I went to see them and I saw them at the palace and I didn't really like them live. I mean, you know, maybe they they were too earnest maybe. And I don't know, they wore their pants too high or something, you know, it was just like goofy stuff. And I might've felt the same way sort of about Lloyd Cole and the commotions too, around the same time. I, you know, once I saw them live, it might have been, I might have been into the replacements by this time. So I might have had like, you know, oh, yeah, you know, just, just an attitude like, oh, you're just too polished, too, you know, you look kind of nerdy up there. I want to see somebody get outrageous and break things and cut loose and, you know, don't be so earnest, you know, I don't know. But now I think I can appreciate big country a little more and Stuart Adamson is that it was his name yeah and he had a, a pedigree he was in the the skids like Susie he was like a er, early punk guy he was in the skids so respect belated respect <laughs> I I love how earnest could be a negative quality <laughs> for Craig back then yeah this but you like did you like you two back then I did but then I also turned on you too I've been back and forth on YouTube. And now, I mean, even I know now, like some people don't really hate that the new record, the, uh, and I actually kind of like it. I mean, I like some of it. And I, I, the Bono uh, audiobook really swayed me more respect for Bono. And I, I like some later uh, YouTube stuff. Uh, you know, I, I don't know how what year did how to dismantle an atomic bomb come out i mean that that record was pretty good and what's the other one uh with stuck in a moment on it holly all that you can't leave behind yeah Yeah, that i love that that's a great album what what year did that come out it seems later but it's probably like at least 15 years old by now god yes it was over years ago so yeah i know these later u2 records that came yeah years ago you know? yeah it came out yeah, 20 yeah. years ago yeah you know but very that, funny yeah, yeah hilarious uh um, all right <laughs> did you holly back to big country did you like you like uh look away did, i did it was you you it was kind of a forgotten gem you're yeah. right i really i liked it but i i like watching well you know i like his whole look his whole aesthetic yeah um i'm not ashamed to say I liked it then. I like it now. And uh, so I enjoyed watching him in this video. Also, you know, I just. Yeah, it was fun. I, uh, yeah. And as kind of a wannabe drummer, I, I do like the drums, the, the the big drum sound. And it was kind of like, this. hey, I know you. Special guest. Oh, that's- <laughs> Special guest on the podcast. Oh, Daddy God. Rosen. We're talking about Big Country's song, Look Away. <laughs> <laughs> I think I just know that one song that everybody in a, in a big country. Yes. Yeah, that's big. Con- yeah. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Bye. 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 Well, that qualifies her to be on the podcast. Yeah. yeah. Big country. She yeah. has an opinion. So there you go. Come <laughs> yes. Patty, come back. <laughs> that leaves. Very good. Okay. Um, would you put them in there like your uh, top five Scottish bands of all time? Anyone? <laughs> Ooh, well, uh, they're under the Bay City Rollers, if you're asking me. Yeah, I know. No, no, no. On your list here, you're on your cheat sheet. No, they. No. W- I don't think they would make the top five. They would not be in the top five. Okay. No, no, because yeah, Aztec Camera, Simple Minds, mm-hmm. Jesus and Mary Chain, Bay City Rollers, Travis. 
Yeah. We okay. already say Be- Bell and the Sebastian. Bell and Sebastian, Cocteau twins. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. I was just I wanted to see where they fit in the. They're, they're below that, but R.I.P. Stuart Adamson. I'm st- sorry for uh, being a snot nosed brat. Yeah. <laughs> in my younger I- years. That's why we weren't. Yeah, we were always wondering why we weren't friends at CSUN, and that's. I I did go see him though. See, I, it wasn't. I liked him enough to see him. I mean, that's really what. To this day, that's really what separates. Uh, you know, a great band for me the the live performance. I mean, their their records could be good, but when you see a band live, you really, you know, decide if they're like the real thing or just kind of a flash in the pan. You know. Was, I stand by that. That was my my first show at the Palladium. Was uh, oh okay, so you saw them later, seeing Big yeah. Country, yeah. And they played in a Big Country twice, which I okay. So uh, that was after Blue, because the first time around they played the Palace, so they were gaining momentum. And uh, yeah, that must have been yeah. probably yeah, must have been 85, 85, 86, probably when I saw them. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I still need to go through those ticket stubs and and do that spreadsheet that i want to do i'll do that put it yeah. in, in retirement someday yeah, yeah. Okay. whenever that happens yeah i just i love the the scottish i uh, like bagpipes it just makes me happy <laughs> bagpipes. happy music bagpipes you consider that happy music <laughs> oh because you're talking about bagpipes being played at funerals yeah, or just anytime you hear a bagpipe. It's just, I think it, it could not, sound. It's not an accordion. It's a. Uh, <laughs> Does uh, an accordion make you accordion uh, make you happy? Is that a happy instrument? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think bagpipes are. There's just something about it. It, it gets you. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That was my high, my high school. You know, the the we were Highlanders and we had Highland dancers and you know. Oh, right. you went you went to Granada. Wow, I, I forgot that. See, I still have it. There you go. Look 